Senior Living Today, brought to you by these fine sponsors. Wires, Inc., First Class Realty, Triangle East, and Ward Specialty Pharmacy. Hello, folks, and welcome to Senior Living Today. Folks, we couldn't do it without you. It's Election Day. I know a lot of you are glad to hear we're coming to the end of that. Yes. <laughs> and we're not going to talk about that tonight. No, we're not. But what we are going to talk mm. about is the key word, fraud. Yes. Things that are happening in Medicare right on your TV and right in front of your screen. Cheryl Brazel, myself, we're tickled to be here tonight to bring you some new updates and some good information. Cheryl, who are our sponsors that kind of allow us to do so this, brother? The folks that make this all possible for us. We have First Class Realty, Triangle East, Brett Hill, and his uh, folks. Mm -hmm. Man, I can't talk this evening, y'all. It's been a long day. We're trying real hard <laughs> to get it right. Uh, buying or selling real estate here in this crazy market, you need to talk to these folks. They're great, great resource, great salespeople. And, Cheryl, that's commercial, residential, just about anything that yep. you are selling. Isn't that that's correct? That's it. That's it. I haven't seen them sell TPs yet, but they may be working on Give that. Give it time. Give, Give it, it time. time. That's it. Uh, Ward Pharmacy, Ward Specialty Pharmacy, a compounding pharmacy. Mm -hmm. Patrick Ignacio is, is the owner, and you know, the, the Patrick's done some things for me, for my wife, for our dog. Yep. I mean, they can take care of your whole family. And I have been really pleasantly surprised at the things he was able to do uh, you know, in the compounding world that really can save you a lot of money. In oh, Cheryl, the idea of even your prescription you know, drug plan, if something pops up, Cheryl has said this before. If you have something that's special, mm -hmm. needs special attention, Cheryl, isn't that where yeah. we need to send them? Yes, absolutely, absolutely. And that's last but not least, Wires Inc., Brian West and his crew, they make that vehicle of yours look prettier, sound better, and drive safer. No question. All at the same time. Folks, we couldn't. <laughs> Cheryl and I sit up here and laugh and joke and have a great time with our great senior population. And you know we love you to death. That's why we bring a lot of the information to you, mm -hmm. and it changes weekly. Yeah. Tonight you're going to find this very, I guess, informative from the standpoint of how things are changing in Medicare. Yeah. Not so much of who we have in Washington, but it seems like it has the trickle-down effect yeah. of coming to us, time. whether it's Social Security, mm -hmm. low-income subsidy, Medicare, Medicaid. But tonight I'm going to get ready and throw it to Cheryl, and I've got a little bit I'm going to add to this. but. Folks, there's so much on TV that we get calls about, is Every it true? Yeah. And so we've done quite a bit of research, along with two other folks involved, to find out, is there fraud in this TV commercials? Is there things that are just unjust? And, you know, Cheryl, I asked the question in the meeting, pre-production. You know, everything on TV we see and hear is true, isn't it? I thought so. Well, I did Or it too. wouldn't be on there, would it? That's what we think, <laughs> and I know you think the same way. <laughs> Folks, we have to have a good time. can be some boring stuff, but I say the word fraud again. Yeah. Cheryl, you want to lead into that and kind of touch base, and these are bullet sure. points, folks, that you want to be aware of when you're sitting at home with that cup of tea, glass of tea, sandwich, and you're watching all these TV commercials that say, you only have a few minutes, call this number. number. Right now, what is everything's that, free. Um, you know, um, the, some of the things we talk about tonight, I, I use my dad, who's 92 years old, as my barometer on a lot of things, and I'll get these phone calls. I saw this thing on TV. <laughs> <laughs> they said I was supposed to get so-and-so for Medicare. Is that true? Uh -huh. You know, And I had to tell them, I said, well, Daddy, uh, probably not. <laughs> it's uh, advertising that leads you to believe mm -hmm. that a certain thing may be true or this may be something that you're eligible for and when you get down to it maybe not well you know sure yeah. a lot of times a lot of points that people will say even as we all are growing up mom and dad would look at me and say joey or cheryl you know if it sounds too good most of the time you'll give it a window to look out of but most of the time it is too good yeah and you're not going to get it the way it's coming across that TV screen. Mm -hmm. And some of the points that Cheryl's going to touch on right now, we want you to be aware of. Second half of the show, I've got a few here I'm going to bring to your attention. Yeah. Tonight is more of an education because you're getting inundated with every TV show in yeah. the world dealing with it, every 
I don't know, Cheryl Comedian, mm-hmm. every spaceship rider, every quarterback, That's everybody right. has their That's own right. message of calling now. Yep. And, you know, the thing to be aware of, because, I mean, we're in you know, annual enrollment period, so yep. you're being bombarded not only this year with political ads, but also with Medicare ads. And uh, fortunately, the political ads, I hope, are going to be ending tonight. Yes. And, uh, in, you know, fortunately, maybe in about three weeks, the Medicare ads will be over with. But, uh, you know, Mr. Joe Namath, a great athlete. Not a question. Uh, no, no, sir. No question about it. But I do not think he is a really experienced individual in the world of, of Medicare, Medicare supplements, Medicare advance plans. And, they're, you know, the, obviously they're uh, operating on for Joe's personality True. to True. Uh, get you to call. And so they'll say things like, um, you know, you, you may be qualified for this free transportation benefit. Mm-hmm. And, you know, what that is involving is certain individuals do qualify for it. But I will tell you this, only about 15% of the Medicare population actually qualifies for Cheryl, that Cheryl, you're telling me, and I didn't know this, folks, <clears> but you're telling me, Cheryl, that only 15% out of all the millions of seniors right. that we have, and folks, you hear it on the TV show, every time that, whether we do it or whether it comes out of some TV commercial, we want to be factual, so we have fact finders touching everything that we say to you here, but when they're looking at 15% only qualify, right. Right. So they're using that as a hook. Yes. Then to get you. Yes. They want you to call. I mean, a lot of these advertisements, you know, there'll be an 800 number for you to call. Mm-hmm. And a lot of these advertisements are tied into call, what are called call centers. And there'll be an, an, in, you know, an individual there, an agent that you'll call and start talking to. And, you know, the, the business model there primarily is to have you purchase a plan over the phone Mm -hmm. from this person and they're going to try to get you to do that in about 20 to 30 minutes in in the you know the world of of telephone calling is called churning and burning no kidding we're we're trying to churn through those numbers and get those folks to go ahead and so you're saying they're trying to put pressure on our seniors yep at home when that phone rings or mm-hmm. that TV commercial and they try to push you to dial that 1-800 number because mm-hmm. I'm listening to what you're saying. And that means they're, they just want you to sign and dine and get out, yeah. not really understand what the product is right. you're buying. Right, Because, I mean, you, you know this, it's not unusual for us to sit down with a client, especially people who are you know brand new yep. to Medicare, uh, I mean, you had some folks in today. I mean, I was in the other office, and y'all were in there for an hour and a half. Yes. Uh, to take care, because you you uncover things as you talk to people. They they thought their situation was this, and after talking to them, I know you uncovered a few extra bits of information, and you realized you had to go in a completely different direction than than what they originally sure, thought. Cheryl, one of the greatest things that at statewide what we do and this came from Cheryl's training even for the new people that are coming in selling force across the state one of the greatest things that we have that we work with and again I say Cheryl was the one that trained this and cut it out listening if you listen to what the client sitting across the table is telling you you've got to match a need with the plan yes and where it's not some highfalutin TV show saying, okay, we've only got 30 minutes, we got to buy, we got to sell, we got to do something, and then I got to call somebody else. Right. No, Cheryl's right. It was over an hour and a half in there, one client. And we went through 14 different plans until we found the one right drug plan, everything yeah. that the male and female wanted. But when they walked out, confidence was high. Cheryl has always taught at statewide make sure when they walk out that door, they understand what they bought. But most importantly, buy local mm-hmm. because they can pick up the phone and do what? Call you and talk to you. And talk that doesn't cost us, anything, right? folks. Talk to us at statewide. Go right ahead. Um, you know, another big hook, mm-hmm. if you will, that, that the call centers will use, or the advertisements are touting is dental benefits. And just the way it comes across, it makes you think, Oh my goodness, man, I can go in here and get dentures and implants and get all my teeth pulled and replaced and do yeah. the, do this and do that. And it's only, again, only about 15% of the population 
is going to qualify for that type of an extensive dental benefit. I agree with you. I agree with you. Yeah, the most of us, you know, we would be qualified to get around a thousand dollar benefit is what, which is not chicken feed, but in in the world of dental work, I think a thousand dollars don't go real far. And folks, that's the reason why, as seniors, and I'll help kind of segue with what Cheryl's telling you. <clears throat> There is what's known now as a senior dental product. What does that mean? Yes, it's an extra cost. Absolutely, Cheryl. Yeah. But you have twenty-five, thirty-five, even forty-five hundred dollars on your high end to spend. Now, let retro back to what Cheryl just said. If you had a thousand dollars and you do one, um, what do you think, Cheryl? A crown, maybe? I would say on a good day. A thousand dollars getting a crown a good day. <laughs> and I've eat up the max on my plan or the plan that they're telling you on TV. And then you turn to your spouse and say, well, I thought I had dental insurance. That's mm-hmm. what they told me on TV. That's precisely what we're talking right. about here tonight. You've got to research. You've got to find out what they're telling you. Is it factual? Because once they take your money, and they line you out. Cheryl, what is the time that you're able on a Medicare Advantage plan with dental vision, hearing, all of what you hear on TV, when can you change that if you were to buy it? The good news is if you you know have purchased something in that fashion here in the last few weeks, you will have an opportunity to make a change this, well, in January, January 1 mm-hmm. through March 30. Correct. It's called the open enrollment period. Mm-hmm. And during that time, if you, you know, decide that, you know what, that Medicare Advantage plan, that particular one is just not right for me, I need to have somebody look at it, you can come to us. I don't care if you bought it from Joe Namath and his guys. Um, you can come to Statewide Insurance Group, mm-hmm. and we can sit down with you and look at what you have and then see if there's something that would, you know, be a better alignment for you. Oh, it's great. Uh, you know, be- better benefits for you. And I want to mention one other thing, Joey that I do, we do get this phone call a lot, and this is probably one that my dad is continually re-asking me about, you know. He says, well, how about that deal where you get money added back to your check, you know? And, uh, and that's talking about Social Security checks? Yeah, is Social that Security what he's checks, getting okay. some money added uh-huh. back to your Social Security checks. Said, call, check your zip code and see if you're eligible, you know. Well, guess what? Um, you got to remember where, um, you know, where the plan giveth, then the plan also taketh away. <laughs> That's well stated. <laughs> and uh, so if there is a situation where there is a, a give back and, you know, $50, $75, um, there's going to be a reduction in benefits somewhere else in the plan. Mm-hmm. Uh, and the first time I heard that, I thought, oh, they wouldn't do that. Yes, they would. And uh, so then I started flipping through a few plans. And I was like, hmm. <laughs> It's and amazing how that works. Isn't it amazing how many different plans that are out there? Cheryl was talking about this recently. 64 different plans, and we're still finding new ones. Yeah. And you ask why there's confusion? <laughs> That's one of the reasons that we have senior living today. And so many people have asked, when are you going to get back on the cooking end of it? When are you going to have your visiting and mm-hmm. doing on location shooting? Folks, October 15th to December 7th is annual enrollment. And for millions of seniors... Is it 15 to 18 counties we broadcast in? Yes, something like that, huh? All of those counties have contacted us local right here in Rocky Mount, North Carolina, at our office, 880 Country Club Road, and we are visible. We are yeah. seen, and questions can be answered legitimately and honestly. But the main thing that Cheryl and I look for is to find that plan that works for you. But Cheryl, I want you to go back and revisit what you just said. If they bought a plan, and I want you to carry us through this, mm-hmm. October 15th to December 7th. Right. And that's what you're hearing so much about on TV. And I know it's hard, it's difficult. Mm-hmm. But Cheryl, before we go to break, what happens if you buy a plan now from TV, from right. whoever? Right. October 15th to December 7th, and you find December 20th, I don't like this plan, am I stuck with it? Yeah. The good news is, again, January 1 to March 30, you have what is called the open enrollment period, and it allows you to make changes in Medicare Advantage plans. Is there any penalty to the client for that? No, there is not. There is not. Uh, And, you know, if you bought a plan, and, and we encourage our folks to do this, if the Medicare Advantage is the route that you want to go, mm-hmm. c- 
contact your if you bought a plan two weeks ago tomorrow morning you need to pick up the phone and call you know the insurance person at your doctor's office and say yep. hey i bought and tell them exactly what you purchased do y'all take that yeah, that's the question you know, do you do, accept do, do this you, plan you know, do you accept this plan are you in this network you know do you, will you accept this product uh because if they say no you got a problem. You got a problem. You know, you got you got to make a change on on January one. In fact, and, folks, what we're going to do? I just got noticed by the producer here. You can tell we're involved with you at Senior Living. We love talking to you, sitting right up here, just like we were in your living room. Six eighteen. We have missed our commercial break. I'm being hollered at. <laughs> when we come back, we're going to talk about an HMO, what Cheryl's talking about, networks, PPO, and a couple more benefits before we close out. Yeah. Stay tuned. We'll be right back after this commercial break. Short commercial break. Senior Living Today, brought to you by these fine sponsors. Wires, Inc., First Class Realty, Triangle East, and Ward Specialty Pharmacy. Statewide Insurers Group gave us choices in our Medicare coverage. Check out their options to answer your insurance needs. The choice is yours. At Statewide Insurance Group, we work with every client as an individual case. We try to find what's going to work for you and your needs. We really do all the research. I like to say we do the nitty gritty so you don't have to. So we can accommodate everything you need from start to finish. At Statewide, we want to find the fit that works for you. You need to give us a call. We can do a life review health insurance, and all of the above. And we're located at 880 Country Club Road, right here in Rocky Mount. And telephone number is 252-316-8166. We look forward to hearing from you. Hey folks, welcome back. And thanks to the producers, guys in the production house here. That was a short little break. <laughs> when we come back, I was going to tell you about networks. You know, a lot of people like, Cheryl, this Medicare Advantage. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it fits in a lot of situations. Yes. Three things I'm going to touch on. Cheryl's going to fill it in. PPO, HMO, they are a form of networks. Yep. If you are not in those networks, your doctor's not in the network, what did Mr. Browse will say right before break? You got to change your plan, yeah. or you got to change your doctor. Yeah. Yes. Medicare Original Plan F, G, N, and so forth. Medicare is your network. You can take it anywhere in the country, and you don't have a problem. So they are. How do I say? There are distinctive differences between an MA Medicare Advantage, mm -hmm. and of course Original Medicare. Yeah. Cheryl, you want to pick it up right there? Yeah. Uh, you know, it's. We, we, we talk about these things all the time, obviously, because this is what we do. But it's, again, we, we talked to you many times before about, you know, we see Medicare as an incredibly individualized mm -hmm. situation. Mm -hmm. Because what works for me is not going to work for Joy. No. You know, what works for Joy does not work for Sam down the street. Even your so, husband and wife, not yes, to cut her in a row, yes, but even husband yeah. and wives mm -hmm. are different plans, have believe different it or plans. not. Yep, sure do. And you just have to understand what's there. You know, one's not good or bad. You just have to understand and make sure this is going to fit what you need to do. Sure. You know, like we'll we'll talk about the Med Advantage for a second, Medicare Advantage plans, and you know they they have networks, which means they have certain groups of doctors and or hospitals mm -hmm. that you would need to use. And I think the simple way to explain the the HMO versus a PPO. The HMO is a health maintenance organization, yes, and is. usually that's a smaller network. Yes, it is. A more localized network. And so if you're a person who doesn't travel a lot, we had I had a lady last week, and I asked her that question. I said, so tell me, where do you go to visit kids? They're not mm -hmm. right here. You know, yeah. here everybody's here. Um, I said, do you travel? You know, do you go anywhere? Well, not really. Every once in a while, you know, I, we take a trip out here or there, and, and uh, 
She said, would I be covered there? I said, you know, if it's an emergency situation, yes. you're covered. They're going to get you back to Nash County and, and, you know, get you where you would be in your network. Very true. Uh, the PPOs, which are preferred provider organizations, they are usually a larger network. They are. And, um, I, you know, I won't mention any particular names, but, you know, there are a couple of national companies in the uh, Medicare Advantage marketplace that literally have national networks. They do. So you can practically go anywhere in the country with those particular plans and they'll treat you just like you're local and again you know they're going to do their utmost to get you stabilized and then get you back home you know to your local environment so mm -hmm. so you're comfortable with with you know your doctors and and your hospital so again you just have to understand you know what the differences are in the plans because medicare uh original medicare mm -hmm. medicare a and b usually if you have that you will have a medicare supplement plan and Medicare supplements, it's, again, it's a different animal. It is totally. Uh, totally different animal. Premium setups are different, you know, things of that nature. It's more, there are not particular networks True. with the Medicare well, supplement. Well, actually, Medicare itself, Cheryl, is yeah. your network. Yeah, you can go anywhere um, that Medicare is accepted. Mm -hmm. You go any, anywhere that Medicare is accepted. And that is and a wide range it. across our 50 states, of mm -hmm. course, as we're looking. Mm -hmm. But i add something back to what Cheryl was saying there. One has to make a decision on what one wants. Mm -hmm. You know, if, if premium is an instant, we had one up in the Roanoke Rapids office, and premium was a big factor, well over $400 a month. And we moved that individual to a Medicare Advantage yeah. plan, yeah. and it ended up being $26 a month. The person was very healthy. Yeah. Underline that, Cheryl, mm -hmm. underline that three times. What does that mean? He wasn't going to the doctor a lot. And Medicare original, as we know it, as Cheryl said, F's, G's, et cetera, what we call alphabet soup, yeah. original Medicare, accepted. But it does not have all of the bells and whistles, right? travel, lodge, et cetera, whatever it may be with that Medicare, that MA, which has what we talked about before, Cheryl, dental, dental vision, vision, hearing. hearing. And even a drug plan, your prescription drug plan. And Cheryl and I are going to talk about that in closing of the show coming up because so many people are coming into the office right. asking. In fact, mm -hmm. Cheryl, I'm not even going to purge on that. Let me throw that to you about okay. what the differences are with prescription drug plans. We know there's been changes. Yes. Take it away, bro. Yeah. Uh, the prescription drug plans are a different animal. Uh, and it's very important that you get the details to whoever's helping you with the drug plans to make sure because it makes a difference. If you're taking a tablet versus a pill versus a powder, you know, versus a, a solution, mm -hmm. a gel, whatever that situation is, that's the information we need to know because it does make a difference in what you're going to be paying. Uh, I, lady today, uh, we had worked on hers last week and, and um, she was coming in today to, to finalize things. Again, more than a 20-minute interview. Yes. You know, it, it takes a while. Uh, long story short, she's, today she was telling me, well, you know, that's so-and-so. And I said, well, that makes a difference. Mm -hmm. you know, and, and seriously, it made a huge Towards difference. Towards that bottom line. Yeah, her, um, her plan, what we had originally figured out, was going to be something in the neighborhood of $2,000 over the course of the year mm -hmm. you know, for all of her prescriptions. And with the information she gave me today, <laughs> it ended up being about $400 mm -hmm. over the course of the year. So, you know, just by her giving me that little bit of information. Just tweaking it a bit like yeah, that. Yeah, she wasn't, you know, didn't realize how important it was for me to know those things. So that's why we tell people, bring your bottles. Bring sure, your bottles in so me, we can look at them. And that know. to you folks should be mm -hmm. some vital information. And you say, Joey, sure, why would that be? Folks, you've sitting in that office. And whether you've come to our office or not, we're encouraging you to call to get your questions answered prior to closure mm -hmm. of December 7th. Yeah. Sure, we may have a change, J1 to March 30th, that we can make a change. Yeah. But if it's done correctly by the local office, you're going to be happy with that plan all of 2023. Yeah. So what am I talking about? We have calls that come in, and you've heard me say this on this show right here. Mr. Brazel, do I buy food this month? <laughs> or do I pay for my medication? Mr. Brazel, do I buy fuel for my automobile so I can take my children to college, or do I pay for my medical bill? Do I pay my premium? Yep. 
the best way to come in is to lay it all out, let Cheryl, myself, and the team at Statewide take a look at it. Cheryl, is there a cost to that? No. I think that was definitively <laughs> no. Bring it in, but you've got a call to set up an appointment. Yes. And it's on your screen, 316-8166. Make an appointment. Find yourself through the Christmas, Thanksgiving holidays to have a peace of mind yes. and know that you're going to be protected, that your drug plan in this hand is going to take care of all the medications in this hand. Cheryl, it's already 28 after. My gosh, I can't believe we didn't even get through half of it, yep. but we'll be back with you next week. You want to bring us almost to a close here? Yes, sir. Folks, give us a call. Statewide Insurers Group, 252-316-8166, and please call to set an appointment. I had a lady came in yesterday, and she said, I came by here one day last week, and nobody was here. And I just looked, I said, ma'am, we're all out. <laughs> You know, everybody in the office, literally, you know, we're all licensed agents, so we are out. I mean, we see people in our office, but we have folks that we have to go see. You know, mm -hmm. for whatever reason, they cannot come in. Um, so we do that. Uh, please call us, set up a time. And, again, we can come to you, but, you know, our, my preference is, I got to tell you, is for you to come to the office so sure. we, we, we're able to see more people if we're not out running the roads. So give us a call, let us help you make some decisions and educate you and get what is best for you to take care of you over the coming year. Great, great advice. Folks, we're local. Cheryl's been in the town family most of his life. Mm -hmm. Myself, right up the road. We are here to serve. The only way that we can help you is for you to reach out. We can't go out and knock on doors and say, how's everything going for you? Please tell us, Mr. Jones, how's everything? You must give us a call. Yes. That is part of the law with Center for Medicare Services. 629, folks, I'm going to close with one last thing with Mr. Braswell. We thank our sponsors. We couldn't do this without you. But most importantly, we thank our clients. Yep. We thank you for what you do. You depend on us. You have confidence in us. Yep. And between the office staff of the four, five, six, seven that we have in there, well over 120 some odd years of experience yes. in Medicare, yep. please depend on us and reach out and ask the questions that you may have and need a response to. Shop local, find you a good church, and folks, we look forward to seeing you next week on Senior Living Today. Cheryl, I appreciate you. Yes, sir. See you folks next week. Have a great weekend. Good night. <laughs>